Hey, welcome to another episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. Another beautiful evening here in good old upstate New York. Uh, it's not, it's like, it's warm, but it's not too hot, but I got a beer I think is appropriate for the occasion. This is VL Provision Saison DuPont, Belgian farmhouse ale, bottle condition, brewed by Brasserie DuPont Torps. <laughs> Imported by Van Bergen to Wolf, Cooperstown, New York. So it's a little hometown thing there. It's a 375 milliliter bottle, 6.5% ABV. And it says, brewed at one of Europe's last farmhouse breweries, Saison DuPont is a four star, world classic example of the Belgian Saison style. Blonde in color with a big rocky head, Saison DuPont is dry and refreshing. Great with all grilled foods. All right, so we got a nice looking beer here. Very Belgian looking, you know. Bright orange but hazy, lots of carbonation, and a huge bright white foamy frothy head. Kind of looks like Duval. It's a, I guess it's that typical kind of Saison smell of, it's flowers and you know like that farmhouse funk that you hear a lot of people talk about. It's not, it's not skunky, I would definitely not call it skunky even though as you can see this is a green bottle. It's the it's just from that Belgian yeast. I'm not sure if it's like qualifies as a, a wild yeast like you'd get in a lambic or a sour, but I think they're like in the same general family. So let's give it a taste here. Cheers. Hmm. Well, they said dry and refreshing. I would definitely agree with that. Um, and in the case of this beer, I think it's more about the drinking sensation than the palate because it's not its not particularly flavorful. It's dry like as soon as it hits the tongue. You know, it's its the slightest bit peppery. Um, it's, uh, it's not like any kind of Trappist beer where it has different fruits and spices going on. It's just kind of like a very generic kind of black pepper kind of sensation. What's interesting is that even though it's like remarkably dry right on, right on the back end, right as you're finishing it, it's very refreshing while it's, act, it's in the mouth. You know, it's very thirst quenching at the time. Um, the aftertaste is, it's not exactly clean, but it's the hops are, you know, the yeast strain or whatever isn't lingering here. There's no real super dry sensation. You know, it's just slightly dry. Um, it's not spicy like, you know, maybe like a, a Trappist uh, triple or something like that might be. I'm gonna top off this. I think adding the yeast actually was a good idea. Um, brought out like a little bit more flavor. Got like a little bit of citrus, a little bit of like biscuity malt kind of flavor on there now. The head is just hanging in there which is really impressive. I don't know if you can see how dirty the uh, bottom of the glass is down from the yeast. Not much else to say on this. I mean, it's, I thought it was going to be like way more robust than this or just like, you know, more stylized or like more, more impressive because it is a genuine old school Belgian Saison. And you know, as the drinkability goes and the refreshing quality goes, you know, it's pretty good. You know, they said have this with the, with grilled foods. Um, yeah, sure, I, I, I would agree with that, but, you know, I, I guess it actually probably would work better with a meal than it, as any kind of, you know, summer refresher or something like that. At least it's not sour. There's really, there's no sour taste in here. Um, although, I mean, sometimes sour can be a good thing, but, um, you know, I have no idea how old this bottle is or, or I mean, there's a code on it, but who knows how to read these things. Um... Yeah, it's okay. I, you know, I was, I had, I had my hopes up pretty high for this one, but you know, it's kind of a letdown. So, uh, I think I'm gonna go with a six, six out of ten for Saison Dupont. You know, it's it's okay. You know, it's an okay, decent, good drinkable beer. Um, I just, I thought there was gonna be way more to this than there actually is, though. Um, so I guess that about wraps it up for this episode. We're gonna try to get some more authentic Belgian, Belgian style Belgian beers this summer. So, thanks for watching this episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. See you next time. Cheers.